Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So today we are just going to be vlogging So I just wanted to hop on here and start today's video I have a few things I want to show you guys that I got done yesterday Put together today stuff like that. So let me just jump right into it first thing being my new little bookshelf Oh my gosh mark put it together yesterday and I just like put all my books on and it looks so good and caster prep series twisted series um, Kind of did like a pink Fish, yellow theme up here. Oh, well, Lynn Painter, Hannah Grace, Colleen Hoover over here. I actually don't have a lot of Colleen Hoover books, which is kind of funny because I thought I had way more than that. But down here, just some random books. More over here. Eventually, once I finish the series, it will have its own little like shelf like this. Also with this one, um, and then poem books. <laughs> so yeah. Oh, and then over here too some more random books. But now I have like more room to grow my collection eventually. I'm not gonna buy books for a minute because I still have so many to read, but I just wanted to show you guys. I think it looks so good. I actually posted a TikTok about it yesterday and some girl commented and was like, you should get like white stickers to make it more seamless because there's so many like screws everywhere. Like you see, I don't know. I think I'm gonna do that because I don't really like the screws. And then I also need to figure out this. I think I just want it to look more seamless than it does with like the silver screws. But yeah, it looks so good and I absolutely love it. And then yesterday I deep cleaned my entire bathroom. It was just time to go through my drawers and my perfumes and stuff and like dust and just deep clean. So let me show you guys all of my drawers down here. First one being this. This was always been organized, but I just like decluttered it. Then down here. Just a bunch of makeup, another makeup bin. So yeah, this used to be very cluttered. Uh, lipsticks, eyeshadow palettes, and then concealer, foundation, brushes, stuff like that. Then over here, organized this, went through our hair stuff, and then this bin used to have like our girl products in it, but I switched it out, I'll show you in a second, for all of our hair clips, claw clips, stuff like that. And then over here, I organized these um, by like, you know, you get it. <laughs> if you're a girl, you know. So I did that. I organized these as well. Hair stuff, tweezers, stuff like that. Random stuff. And then I also went through my perfumes. I really needed to dust the shelf off, which I did. It looks so much better. I went through all of our perfumes. Um, and I got rid of a few because it was just so cluttered, but this looks so much better. Also went through this. We have a lot of dry shampoo, especially from Living Proof. That's like one thing that I get constantly, like PR wise. So we have dry shampoo for days. So I just like empty that out. But yeah, this is our nice little clean bathroom now. That's like all organized and it feels clean knowing that everything down here is like organized. Yesterday and today are probably like the two days that I'm kind of just like doing a reset as in deep cleaning. Um, the bathroom needed to be done, which I'm glad that I got that done yesterday because we weren't really doing anything. Did my bookshelf, which I'm very excited about. And then now I'm currently doing laundry. So today is Tuesday and I'm leaving this Friday for like a little birthday weekend trip. I'm staying in Florida. Um, I'm just going to the other coast. So that should be fun. And I'm staying there for um, a few days, which will be exciting. Celebrating my birthday and also my friend's birthday because <laughs> we literally have the same birth month so that's pretty exciting so i'm doing that this weekend so i just kind of wanted to get everything cleaned and then also the following weekend i have a friend coming to stay with me um for the same amount of days i'm gonna be gone like three days i think so i just want to like deep clean everything and then clean it again before she gets here so yeah that's currently what i've been doing got ready today i took a shower you're still kind of like drying though um yeah, it's actually really nice outside, so yeah, I've just been cleaning. I'm actually getting ready to read though, because I don't really have anything going on, but I just wanted to show you guys my bookshelf and then the room, and then I think my laundry literally just finished, so I'm going to switch that out, but Ellie's currently at tryouts right now, which is pretty exciting, so I'm sure she'll share how that is going, because today is day two of tryouts actually, so yeah, so welcome to today's vlog. <laughs>
Y'all just got another bouquet of flowers for my birthday from my management. They're literally the sweetest ever. I love them so much. Like, look how pretty this is. I had to share because this is gorgeous. Like, every single flower is so pretty. And like, now look at my desk. There's so many flowers. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be singing the cha-cha slide. Hi guys, so I just got back from softball like an hour ago and we had a scrimmage right after school. So school gets out at 2.15 so right after school I had to get my stuff out of my dad's car and then change and then we warmed up at 2.14, I mean 2, 2.45 and then we started at 3.15. We played, we got a cupcake from our JV coach. But I don't think he's doing cuts. I don't know. Even if he does, I mean, he might be doing cuts this season because I kind of think he is. But I don't know. I don't think I've done bad. I think I've done pretty good. Because, like, he knows I'm not bad, though. Because, like, I've played better than I am right now. But I also haven't played him forever. So I think I should be good. This is the second day of tryouts. We also have tryouts tomorrow night. He hasn't texted anything like in the group chat or whatever about like, he hasn't said anything about like what, like where it is. Cause yesterday it was just like normal like tryouts and then today it was a scrimmage. And then I don't know what tomorrow is gonna be or like what time or anything, but I'm hoping it's not after school cause that was the worst thing like ever. It was horrible going right after school because like I had to change at school and it was just gross and I had to carry my softball bag through school. So that's pretty much it for softball um tryouts. I also don't have hitting anymore because he like gave the spot away because I had scrimmages so I could never go to any of them. Yeah so we don't have conditioning and I don't have hitting so it's pretty much nothing right now after tomorrow until season start. I don't know like how soon practice starts and stuff but I'm pretty sure I'm hoping I don't get cut. But that is it from me. That is all I have to say. So now I'm going to give the camera to that. It's currently 6.20 and I'm leaving at 7 because I'm going to the movies with my friend. So we're going to this place called Cine Bistro. It's like a movie theater that serves dinner. Kind of cool. I've done it before, but not with Cine Bistro. It's in Sarasota, closer to like Siesta Key. It's like 30 minutes away from me and the movie's at 8. And we have to get there beforehand because of their like age roll. I don't know. It's really weird. I think it's because it's like there's a bar there. Um, but anyways, so me and her are going at eight. We're going to see anyone but you. I've already seen it, but like I'll see it again because it was a great movie and I loved it. She hasn't seen it, so it like worked out. Uh, so I need to pick out what we're wearing and I'm also bringing her a sweatshirt. So now I need two, but I'm just wearing leggings because she said that it's like really cold there. She's been before, so I'm excited. And the place also has unlimited popcorn like that's the best if you go to the movie theaters and don't get popcorn you are doing life totally wrong so i think i'm just gonna do my black lulu lemon leggings with my uggs but this place is like a bit fancier we were talking about that we were like we want to wear sweatpants but it's like too fancy to wear sweatpants so we're gonna go with leggings so leggings and then a sweatshirt but let me pick the ones that I want to wear out. Okay, this is what I'm wearing <laughs> to the movies. Comfy, but like still kind of cute because it's a bit nicer. Um, but Uggs, leggings, and this crew neck. <laughs> Hi, Winnie. And then I'm bringing her these two so she has two to choose from because they're kind of different. This one's a bit more oversized, especially for me. And then this one's a bit smaller, not so oversized. Which one do you think she'll pick, Winnie? <laughs> but yeah, bringing those and keys, I'm ready, so. I'm gonna hit the road and go see a movie. I'm excited. I actually really love the movie Anyone But You. It's a great movie. So yeah, let's head out. <laughs> so I just got out of the shower and I just did a bunch of my schoolwork. I was missing a lot of it and I did like a bunch of math and then I did some medical presentation. The medical presentation thing or like not a presentation the powerpoint isn't finished yet but it almost is but that's pretty much it i was just doing that for like a whole two hours i think it was for a while and so i got a lot of done i got i did 10 like math like topic things that i need to do like every week to make up i did 10 to make up for last week and then this week's one is due this week's one is due on friday so i have like a little while to do the 10 for this week but last week i just finished that and so 
tomorrow is supposed to be 80 degrees and it's hasn't been that hot in forever so I'm not really excited about that because I had a cute outfit planned for tomorrow and if it's gonna be 80 degrees it's a hoodie and jeans and but if it's gonna be 80 I don't know if I'm gonna wear it but I don't think it's gonna be that hot so I'll be fine but now I'm going to give the camera to Emma. I just did my skincare. I'm going to bed, but I'm home up from the movies. So, you know, I went to Cinebistro. <laughs> WTF. So I got a Caesar salad and popcorn and a drink. Guess how much it was? It was 40 bucks. And that wasn't even including the movie ticket. Um, the movie was great. Loved it. Totally worth it. The movie seats were like fantastic. It was a great movie theater. Uh, great experience, I had a great time. Um, we both, she really loved the movie, so that's good. 40 bucks for a salad, popcorn, and a drink is crazy. Is that like crazy to you guys? I mean, I get it. Like I knew going into it, like the prices were gonna be like ridiculous. Cause the movie ticket price wasn't even that bad. It's just like the food is like where they get you. But yeah, I had a great time. Will I go back? Probably not. I would probably just go to like a regular movie theater and just get snacks or like bring my own food and like sneak it in, you know? <laughs> um, but it was good. I'm glad that I went cause like it was my first time and now I know never to get a salad and a drink and popcorn <laughs> again. But no, I had a great time. So now I'm home, did my skincare, gonna go to bed. Tomorrow is Wednesday. Don't really know what I'm gonna do tomorrow, but we'll we'll figure it out. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and we'll see you very soon back with more videos. Bye guys. Bye.